Behold, the days are coming, declares the Lord, when I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel and the house of Judah. What is this covenant? Why did the Lord declare this promise over 600 years before it came to be? What purpose did it serve? Was it to bring fear to those living outside this hope? Was it to bring joy to those who were filled with sorrow? This covenant, 600 years later, would manifest in a baby. Therefore the Lord himself will give you a sign. Behold, the virgin shall conceive and bear a son and shall call his name Emmanuel. Emmanuel. Do we truly understand the meaning of this name? We sing it in Christmas carols, we read it on Christmas signs, we even buy Christmas cards with it written inside and ask people to come to our Christmas Eve and worship Emmanuel. And yet we merely glance over the meaning behind this name, Emmanuel, God with us. Three simple words. Three simple words that changed everything. Three words. One name. All which prove that Jesus coming down as a baby was God incarnate. The plan of redemption put in place at the beginning of time, prophesied about hundreds of years before his arrival. There is no greater love. A humble beginning. Coming down in the form of a servant born in the likeness of men, all for one purpose, to conquer death. You see, God with us points to the cross. God with us points to eternity. Because of God with us, we no longer need to fear death. Because of God with us, we can spend eternity with Him. God with us gives us a reason to celebrate today. God with us gives us hope. Who is hope? 